Good shot, Katie. But you're shooting a little low, and that's because you're getting tired. Maybe it's a good time to take a break. Good idea, Stacy. This would be a perfect opportunity to show the folks some of your instinctive shooting. Stacy, that was incredible shooting. I'm really impressed. That's what's so nice about instinctive shooting, Katie. Anyone can learn to do it, and it's so simple. So let's recap the things now we've already learned. Focus. Concentrate on small target point with both eyes open. The arrow becomes your finger as you point at the target. Draw. Bow arm out, slightly bent. Elbow parallel with shoulder, bow slightly canted. Draw arm elbow is even with shoulder, never below. Draw bow in one smooth continuous motion while leaning slightly forward. Release and follow through. Come to anchor point. Relax fingers. Release arrow and hold form until you see arrow strike target. Katie, that's wonderful. You certainly have been a good student, and well, it's thank really you. been a pleasure <laughs> teaching you. My pleasure. You're great. Thanks. And isn't it a lot of fun? A lot of fun. And now we've come to that special moment when I'd like to leave you folks with a special thought. For a long time ago, when I left the old chief, who was 100 years old, I said to him, Chief, I've come to tell you goodbye. He looked at me sternly and said, don't ever say goodbye. You are a Cherokee, for we've adopted you and made you one of us. No Cherokee says goodbye. It's always stayut, stayut, which means be strong, mentally, physically, spiritually, and socially. So I say to each of you what he taught me so long ago, the prayer, as he made the circle with his arms. Oh, great spirit, guide me this day that I may respect and use wisely all the blessings you have given from the good earth. And may that circle of your love forever reach out, bringing to all love and peace.